Hey folks, there's been a lot of talk these last couple of years about police weaponry, both militarized and otherwise, and how responsibly they should be used, if at all. But one of the newest uh, innovations in police science is a bowler wrap, a small taser looking device that shoots out an eight foot long Kevlar cord uh, with two barbed hooks on each end that wraps around suspects, rendering them unable to move if they're standing still and just tripping them if they're running away. The internet came ablaze almost immediately when it was discovered that Seattle police intended to start using the devices as part of a pilot program, citing safety concerns such as the barbed hooks and suspects falling and breaking bones. Some also have an issue with company Rap Technologies' messaging, comparing the device to a centuries-old tool used by Argentinian cowboys to wrangle cattle. Only in this case, the cowboys are cops and the cattle are people with mental illness, if I'm interpreting their website correctly at least. But as more and more departments around the country, and indeed the world, adopt bowler wrap, there's plenty of folks that don't see it as an issue, and in fact see the device as a safer option than a taser, much less a gun. I mean, I guess I'd rather be shot at by a future lasso than a gun if I had to choose for some reason, but the true safety of these things remain to be seen. What do y'all think? An effective method for de-escalation, or just more so-called torture tech? Let us know, and stay tuned for our three-hour retrospective on Donald Trump's blog.